Welcome back to you guys. It's time for another light novel review. Excited for this one. Welcome once again to my channel, guys. This is going to be on the third volume of God's Games We Play. It is um, pretty intense into the story. Um, Anime-wise, I believe it's the last episodes, maybe a little bit more beyond the last episodes of the actual anime series that we got. Um, we are seeing a little bit more development in a few characters, uh, but also introduction of this guy. Well, not really introduction, because she was already introduced, um, but more of her. So, in inside of the volume, we do get some... Uh, nice artwork, um, colored, full colored, of all the character girls that are essentially part of his, like, no way harem, but it is uh, um, harem, <laughs> none the least. Um, so, every one of them uh, has a attribute that really uh, does well for, for her. Um, we have uh, Nil Reckless, who is uh, a, a, kind of a, a new character here. And then we have this girl, again, from, from the beginning. We don't know who she is until halfway, or past halfway, Yuboros, which is a goddess, and she joins the group as well. So, before anything, guys, if you haven't done so by now, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Give some love by comments, liking, and sharing. You guys can follow me on social media or other places by checking the description below. I do have volume one and two of the light novel of God's Games We Play, as well as reaction to the anime here in my channel. Uh, this was brought to you by Yan On. They did send me this copy to review for you guys. Again, you guys can buy this online. Um, I highly recommend you to go online uh, unless there's specials in your bookstore, but uh, it is $16 physically, um, but some bookstores sometimes have a 15% off or a 10% off, which you'll save yourself, you know, a dollar or two there, um, or uh, Barnes & Noble sometimes do uh, buy one, get one free, uh, but a lot of good specials are online, so go to Yen Press dot com and you'll see the different uh people and websites that legitimately sell um this this copies and you guys can see the best way and the best specials because i personally believe especially if you buy in bulk is the way to do it is online so go check them out um okay so the um at the series continues with them essentially they're trying to reverse losses and the first half of the volume is them going against a goddess who has never lost before. And um, she is definitely one not to mess with. Um, she goes against the person who's trying to win uh, and reverse her losses, but she loses. And she wagers um, um, the wins or, or the... I guess the the buffer wins of the other characters. So our main character, uh, Fay, um, he decides to go against this goddess, and this is where we kind of get with the the whole three lies uh, or three little tricks of the god. And this is uh, volume, not volume, sorry, um, chapter three of of the. Uh, volume three and in it the goddess decides to basically trick him as much as possible um, and within the game Faye is able to figure out every single um, reason that they were able to cheat and essentially is she used uh, his comrades the girls that are part of the light novel she uses her his comrades to cheat against him the problem is is that one of them has a limited power she cannot uh, use her power past a certain time and past a certain amount of times and she kind of has like a buffer time and because of it he catches on to it the goddess doesn't know about the buffer time and eventually he figures out you're not really cheating yourself you're making my uh comrades that you essentially make them like the judges like 
make sure that I'm not cheating, um, actually be the ones that cheat for you, uh, which is a very smart way to do it. Um, and she's very impressed. She is able to reverse their losses and they go immediately almost into uh, um, a labyrinth of no return, which is uh, chapter five. <clears throat> this is where I'm at. Um, she does show up eventually she's like chasing after them and eventually finds them in this labyrinth and essentially the labyrinth they're there to rescue certain people um until you find a certain secret item or until you complete the labyrinth you're not able to leave the game so there's a group of people that are stuck in the game having to relive it relive it relive it until they win it certain rules to the game is if one of your team members dies everyone dies and they have to reset all the way to the beginning the only thing that you keep is the knowledge that you gain from passing those levels so it becomes where you essentially have to finish the game in a perfect shriek right don't get hurt don't get killed um be all these bosses and so so forth um they do end up finding the secret weapon um and through like this huge um monster that they have to defeat and she shows up and basically shows how op she is because again she's a goddess and uh yeah that in a nutshell is this volume don't want to give a lot of details because like so many other series this one really relies on the fact of the games how the games work how the games end up um and i don't want to give too much more about that character wise do i like it uh you know it's a harem and it's in its own way that's not really a harem but it is a harem you know he has all these girls that are part of his team the team bonding is feels very um like unrealistic like the girls are all over him essentially in the sense of they see how great he is and all this which again he is a great and he's very smart but at the same time he's he's not he's not a god right he's not all that either so um i don't know maybe because i'm a guy and i'm like i want that no nah, i'm kidding uh but it, i mean it just kind of feels that way it feels a little forceful the relationships between him and the girls um I think the best part of this series is unfortunately the games um the characters themselves are a little bit predictable in the sense of he's going to figure it out uh how to defeat the game right and you have the dipsy one who is going to be like oops i died again so we have to go back to the beginning a hundred times or whatever how many however many, many times they have to do it um and you have like the the one who is in the background she's smart but doesn't voice her voice too much because she doesn't want to overstep some someone's steps and the one girl who is strong and everything but still needs a leader like him to guide her through the the thing so it just feels like very cookie cut characters that you get in other series so unfortunately i don't think it's the best part when it comes to character development but it does have good games so if you're, if you're into a series like where they bet and all that and they figure out how to how to do certain games this one's for you so uh there's three volumes out go check them out uh the whole first anime season is out as well so you can watch it you can read it you can buy the manga i'm not really sure if it's out yet but uh probably will be out soon so thank you guys so much for watching this if you haven't done so by now subscribe to my channel give some love by commenting liking and sharing and i will see you next time and like always don't be strangers. See you guys.